Okay, YouTube. We're building a stand for our ground blind. I had it on a pallet last year or a skid. It was starting to rot. So uh, I want to put it five foot off the ground, which it is built out of four by fours and two by fours. Uh, standard 16 inch center construction, as you can see. And we're gonna use OSB for the floors. I figured I didn't need to film all that because anybody gonna build something, they know what 16 inch center standard construction is. I used a four by four down the center and there's a reason for that. It just, uh, with that OSB being on the floors, I'm gonna double wrap it with uh, tar paper. That's where it's completely waterproof. And it should last the uh, rest of my seasons. So ain't nothing like it, but just to get after it. So let's do this. That's the first piece of roof and felt paper, or tar paper we call it. I'm running them opposite of the way my uh, OSB flooring's going. I only put four staples in the corners because the floor is going to hold it down, keep the bugs out, keep the everything waterproof. After the two sheets of tar paper are rolled out, the opposite direction because it don't make a shit. As you can see. Then we start laying our OSB in the right direction. And then we're going to put tar paper over it and go all the way over the side. On both sides. Okay. That's the first layer of OSB sandwiched between one piece of uh, felt paper. Now we're gonna put on another half inch piece of OSB, which will give us a one inch thick floor sandwiched between two pieces of felt paper that will be completely waterproof. You'll notice as I put these layers on, I tack them down with roof and felt paper staples, roof and staples. That's just to keep it from moving because when I come back, I'm gonna shoot it with the nail gun. But uh, this is just to hold it so it don't slip slide away. Okay, that's the floor sandwiched between OSB. One inch of OSB. Felt paper top and bottom. Fix and put the stand out on the side. See how she looks. Figure out what side we're gonna make the front and the back and all that good stuff. And we'll see what happens from there. It's all nailed. I'm gonna come back and put wood screws through all these joints just to be safe, but it's gonna be in the woods. Stands all nailed, screwed. The pop-up's not attached it all the way. But I'll be able to fold it down for in transit when I put it on the trailer and bring it out there to the field. All we got left to do is build me a little ladder. That'll be about, and we'll throw some paint on there. That'll be about it. All right. Next video will be in the woods. Got a little lighter. Got a couple chairs in there. As you can see, I'll tack it all down when I get it in there. And then that's the tie to tie down with to the stand. But everything's okie dokie smoky. <laughs>